keeping up with our motto let learning be a joy and teaching a pleasure here we are with a remote teaching and learning process to bridge the gap happy learning students a warm welcome to all the students of thakur vidya mandir high school and junior college today i am going to teach mathematics for standard 1 topic find the difference hello children today we are going to learn an interesting topic find the difference this topic is not about numbers or tables there is something more about it you have to wait and watch before we begin with our topic let's play a game spot the differences here i am going to show you two beautiful pictures but did you observe something yes the pictures are similar but if you observe the pictures carefully you will be able to tell few differences between both the pictures let me tell you the meaning of the word difference your difference means the things that are not similar so now let's begin with our game children first we will begin with the tree If you observe both the pictures carefully you will observe the difference between both the trees in the first picture the tree is big whereas in the second picture the tree is small i know you all are observing the animals too there are two beautiful animals in both the pictures a monkey and an elephant in the first picture the monkey is in front of the elephant and in the second picture the monkey is behind the elephant so children can you observe any other difference in the picture yes there is one more in the first picture the first cloud is half hidden behind the tree whereas the second picture the first cloud is fully visible so students did you all enjoy the game so let's begin with our topic find the difference observe both the pictures given below find out and tell the differences between them students i very well know that once you see the pictures you will remember your indoor and outdoor games periods in school so students which game are the children playing yes it is a football game football is an outdoor game the children are playing football in the garden in order to find out the differences you all have to first carefully observe the pictures which almost look similar i am sure you all must have observed the differences in both the pictures so now let's begin with it first let us count the birds we can see two birds in the first picture and in the second picture we can see four birds in the first picture we can see one flower but in the second picture the flower is not to be seen in the first picture the boy is in front of the girl and the girl is behind the boy whereas in the second picture the girl is in front of the boy and the boy is behind the girl and students did you observe the colorful clothes of the children In the first picture the boy has worn red pants and in the second picture the boy has worn yellow pants In both the pictures we can see children playing football In the first picture the ball is big in the second picture the ball is small In the first picture the butterfly is far away from the ball in the second picture the butterfly is nearer to the ball In the first picture the grass shown in the area where the children are playing is less whereas in the second picture it is more so students we have found out maximum differences between the two pictures so did you all enjoy it students let's have more fun here is another interesting game for you spot the differences you can draw both the pictures in your notebook and you can also note down the differences in your notebook so let's begin with it the tree in the first picture is small 
whereas in the second picture the tree is big. Now let us count the chickens. In the first picture we can see three chickens, but in the second picture we can see only two chickens. Students, in the first picture can you see one bird flying? But the bird is far away from the tree, whereas in the second picture the same bird is shown near the tree. And there is something missing in the first picture. Any guesses, students? Yes, students, you all are correct. The sun which gives us light and heat is missing. So, students, now we have finished finding out the differences between both the pictures. I hope you all have enjoyed the game. I hope all of you have enjoyed learning mathematics today. So, students, keep learning something new every day. Thank you.